Hi, I'm Charlie. I'm just a regular guy with hopes and dreams like everybody else. But that's not important right now. What is important is science. And what's really important is research. And what's really, really important is cancer research. I'd like to introduce you to Ferda. Hi, I'm Ferda. Ferda works as a scientist here at the University of Cambridge. Ferda has recently revealed some awesome stuff to do with stem cells, right? Yes, stem cells. We have recently found new type of uh, stem cells in the adult lung, and this cell has ability to change and became different type of uh, cells in the lung. Like this guy. Just as this bad boy can turn into a variety of different letters, these stem cells can turn into a variety of different lung cells. Yes, meaning together in the right framework, they are able to replicate lung. So are we building an actual lung? Yes, in a way. Like Frankenstein. Are we making Frankenstein? No, we are not making Frankenstein. Oh, no, that would be silly, wouldn't it? I'd like to introduce you to someone else, Michaela. Hi, I'm Michaela. Michaela runs the lab here in Cambridge. What exactly is it that we're trying to do? We want to add these stem cells to scaffold made of matrix and let them grow into lung tissue. This tissue will be a 3D representation of the human lung and will show us how the cells communicate with each other throughout space. We can use this tissue then and ask what happens when we add cancer cells. And how are we going to do it? Using a bioreactor. A bioreactor? A drawing of bioreactor. In order to study lung tissue, we need to have a right amount of oxygen, nutrition and temperature which gives them right uh, growth condition. This is why we need bioreactor. So, how will this help cure cancer? Lung cancer is the biggest cancer killer worldwide, and we really do not understand enough of how these tumors develop. This research can change this. I'm expecting a massive leap of learnings from today's 2D petri dish cultures to the 3D lung and a bioreactor. The future impact is huge. Just imagine the day that we can grow a precise replica of a lung tumor and can actually test what is the right and most efficient drug treatment for this patient. Model systems like that can be of course used for any kind of cancer. The potential of the bioreactor goes far beyond the lung. So how do we do it? How do we build it? I want to build it. We need everybody's head to get this off the ground including you. That's why we are crowdfunding. Together we can make this a reality. And if you want to be rewarded for helping out with this project, just check out the perks on the right-hand side of the page. Now, Charlie, if you don't mind, I have to get back to fighting cancer. 